Good morning, health lovers. It's Mercedes, and welcome back to the channel. Welcome, welcome. All right, so this morning I'm going to the mainland and I'm gonna do some yoga, yin yoga to be specific. It's my favorite yoga. I call it uh, my lazy yoga or intentional girl, girl yoga, which when you do yoga, it's intentional anyway, but yin yoga is my absolute favorite, okay? And then I'm gonna go to the grocery store because I need a few things for my cleanse. So I came over to the coffee shop to do a little bit of work in the next 15 minutes. Um, I'm not going to get anything from the coffee shop because I'm doing my 30 day wilderness cleanse right now and they don't have raw food here and I don't want any tea. I have my coconut smoothie and I have two coconut waters so I'm pretty good to go as far as food and beverages go. But um, yeah, I'll show you uh, what the yoga studio looks like. I'm going to get there 15 minutes early like they suggested. You never want to be late to a yoga class because everybody's setting their intention and um, it's just really weird to walk in, you know, when it's so quiet. So I'm going to make sure I get there in a good amount of time. All right, so we made it to the yoga class. I'm so excited. This is my first one. Okay, so I'm gonna go to the restroom because this class is for an hour and 30 minutes. Very cute in here. Health lovers, that was the best yin yoga session. And I've had many yin yoga sessions. They've all been the best and that was the best too, okay? I just feel so calm and at ease. And I learned so much in that class. Like I learned that yin yoga is specifically to lubricate the joints, bones, and ligaments. And for a while, I thought the only way that I could do that was with drinking water. So sometimes when I like stretch out, I'll hear my, um, my joint pop and blood flow and my bones have been a big concern for me um, as far as what to take care of when it comes to my body. So I'm always trying to make sure that I'm getting enough calcium, that I'm uh, taking herbs and eating plants to help uh, fortify my blood flow, uh, especially with sickle cell. So to just know that yin yoga is really good for helping the ligaments, bones, and joints, it, it just made me feel so good to know that there is something else that I can do to really help my body on my life journey. And the teacher, she was amazing. I love the energy that I just felt from doing that class. This morning I wasn't gonna come and I'm so glad I got up and came anyway. And the studio is just so cute. Like I love a cute yoga studio, okay? It just gives me all the good aesthetics that I need in my life. And I did get some merchandise, all right? So I got this $10 shirt um, and it says Centered on Yoga. Amelia Island, Florida is my home. <laughs> I love it, super cute. Now I'm headed to Publix grocery store. I will show you what we get from Publix. I've only been to Publix one time before and that was when I first started my YouTube journey. My best friend, Erin, she drove me all the way to Nashville to go to Publix. Like that's real love. <laughs> 
<laughs> when your friend will drive you so you can create content. So shout out to you, Erin. I love you, girl. All right, so I made it to Publix and I need to get some laundry soap. Usually it is provided, but we don't have any right now and I have to wash clothes today. So I was just looking at all the different ingredients and the plant-based soaps. And the one that I decided to go with would be Nine Elements. I definitely believe whatever I put in my laundry definitely matters because it's on my clothes. Therefore, get it in my skin, which is the largest, largest organ. So I like this one the most out of all that I've read. I like that it doesn't have any synthetic fragrances, no brighteners, thickeners, dyes, or artificial preservatives. And it uses vinegar and lemon essential oil. And it says it doesn't leave a vinegar odor behind. So I'm rocking with this one. All right, so this is our public grocery haul. I have the detergent, some pork, some mushrooms, cucumber, some hot peppers. And I don't have immediate access to fresh juice and these have really been holding me over. I love Lakewood. Most of the time they're made uh, not from concentrate, but this one is made from concentrate. I have two coconut waters, they were the last ones, and I have some avocados. I'm gonna be out for a while, so I got this uh, freezer bag and I'll just continue to use this on all of my uh, trips to the grocery store. And this toothpaste is for one of my coworkers. But yeah, that's that's what we got from Publix today. Okay, so I decided to go back on the five o'clock ferry instead of the twelve o'clock ferry so I can have a little time to do some of my much needed work around the Wi-Fi because uh <laughs> The Wi-Fi isn't very good on the island, but um, I just have my groceries here and my yoga mat, so I'm toting a little bit right now. But the health food store is like right here, hi. And I don't want to Uber there because it's like right here. So I'll just carry the bag, put my phone away so I can have a more comfortable walk. All right, so I made it to the health food store and I really need some lip chap because I've been wearing my Anastasia lip gloss and that is reserved for special occasions. Okay, so I'm thinking I'm going to go with Zumbo Kiss because I like the Zoom brand. Rosemary Mint, um, Almond Orange, Tea Tree and Lavender. Hmm. I think we'll go with almond orange. <laughs> this look like it'll last me for the entire year, okay? Now, I also need some tahini and hemp seeds and nutritional yeast, okay? So, I believe the tahini is this away. Okay. Excuse me. So I'm gonna get this one. I've been enjoying this one. I usually get the once again, but after tasting this one, I'm a fan. All right, so they have nutritional yeast. So I'm gonna go ahead and get a bag of that and then find out where the hemp seeds are. Okay, I found the last thing on our yeah. list, which would be hemp hearts. And I got the one that's on sale, $8.99 for organic, which is nice. I would really like to get this one pound bag, but $21.99, I'm not gonna spend that today because I am gonna get a raw vegan treat. Health lovers, I stopped moving for the day, well, for right now. And I'm just feeling good, just sitting. It's a nice breeze. Okay, I'm feeling it in the music. The music is just so peaceful, okay? No words, just how I like it. Now, the only thing that I didn't show you that I got from the health food store would be goji berries. I'm gonna have this in my fruit bowls in the morning, and who knows, maybe a couple salads. I'm gonna have to soak them a little bit, because um, sometimes they can be a little hard. Um, but let's see, this has a good source of potassium, vitamin A, vitamin D, iron, calcium, 
and I heard that these are really big in Asia. Okay. And I also picked up an essential oil. Okay, that was not on the list, but your girl loves essential oils, and I bet you can't guess what the kind I got. I've never seen this one before, but when I saw it, I was like, oh, it's so me, I need it. <laughs> it says naturally lovable. <laughs> It says it's a romance blend, okay? So it has lemon oil, orange oil, sandalwood, elong elong, and jasmine absolute, okay? So I haven't even smelled it yet. I'm not gonna open it because I'm gonna put it in my bag and I don't want it to be open, not even a little bit into just waste. So I'm gonna wait, but I bet it smells amazing. And I have the raw vegan treat that I was telling you about, okay? So when I come here on Sundays or Saturdays, I really like to go in that cooler I showed you on one of the vlogs and get a raw vegan treat, okay? Food that is prepared that I don't have to cut up or do anything to, I just simply enjoy it. So, you know, I got some cheesy kale chips. I've been wanting some chips, so I love that I can have a dehydrated kale snack and it'd be all good, all raw. All right, so I have a fabulous raw chocolate mousse. Now they had a big dessert in there. They had like an apple cobbler and they had like an orange creamsicle cheesecake. But I said, I'm gonna stick with this one and just get something small for today. All right. And then we have curry samosa. Oh my gosh, looks delicious and it has a sauce on the side. I don't know if you can see it right there. And last time it wasn't enough sauce. So you know what I did? I got some cashew cheese for dipping, okay? <laughs> As you can see, I'm super excited about my raw vegan lunch. I've been living my best raw vegan life and I ain't mad at it. I thank God, thank you Lord, thank you Lord. Cause it ain't always like this. So I'm just thanking God. And I know um, just moving forward, God's gonna continue to make sure that I have everything I need to live my best, healthy, inspired life. So uh, aside from that, I'm going to go ahead and work. You know, that girl got that new MacBook Pro. Uh, it's been a long time coming y'all. You just have no idea been a long time coming I, I deserve I deserve what's going on right now I do okay when all you can do is be grateful like it's a it's a beautiful feeling and a beautiful place to be so you know what before I do any work I'm gonna shut that put it aside and just enjoy this food okay I have to go back to the island at 5 p.m. and I have about four hours right now. So while I'm eating, I wanna to talk to some family. So I'm probably gonna call my mom, probably call my sister, text my other sister back. But yeah, you all, I don't plan on vlogging anymore for today. I'm just gonna enjoy, um, I love vlogging, but I gotta cut it off now, get into that focus mode after I finish my meal and talking to family. Um, I've been receiving a few sponsors for the channel, which I'm like, sponsors, that's so great. <laughs> Getting free product or money, that, that's really nice. And I want you to know something, I will never sponsor something on this channel that I don't believe in and that I haven't tried and know works for me. So, you gotta pay attention to those sponsors real quick. Um, then I'm doing some applications. Well, first I got to do a resume. You know how you're trying to get a certain job so you have to renew your resume to make it fit that job. So I got to do that. But if nothing else, I feel accomplished for today because my main focus has been this wilderness cleanse, getting closer to God. And um, I feel like I'm doing that. Uh, being intentional, getting up, going to yoga, stretching. Uh, fortifying my body, grocery shopping, and tailoring the cleanse day by day. Um, just learning more about myself. So even if I did nothing on this computer today, I feel completely satisfied in all the work that I have been doing for the last couple of weeks. The work that I've been doing in my adult life, okay? 
Sometimes I don't think I show enough appreciation for where I am and how far I've come, um, for the lessons I've learned, uh, for the things that I started doing right after doing them questionable for so long. All right. But until the next vlog, thank you all so, so very much for watching. Please let me know how your cleanse is going. Please let me know how, how you're feeling. Okay, how are you feeling after um, 14 days of cleansing? I know it's different for everyone, so please feel free to leave it in the comments below. And I love you. Peace. Until next time.